everyone, it's Apari here, and oh my god, someone right beside me has my name with two little circles beside it and slashes through the circles. Like, what even is that letter called? Can someone please tell me, like, how to say that letter in the comment section down below? Because how do you even pronounce this username? Apari O? I don't think that's how you say it because there's slashes through the O's. But anyways, what is going on, everyone? It's Apari here, and welcome back to another spooky Animal Jam video. Because every single video that I post in October is going to be spooky. Just getting into that Halloween spirit. But today we're going to be answering the age-old question in Animal Jam. How do you get rich quick in AJ? So I know a lot of people aren't as fortunate as me and they don't have a lot of people sending them rare to Mondays 24-7 So they can't really get a million gems as easily as I did But with these simple steps that I'm going to be telling you in this video You will have a million gems in no time. I promise every single person in AJ is just gonna be walking around with a million gems Thanks to this video. So let's get started So we're just gonna start off really simple and for the first thing that you have to do if you ever want to see a million gems on your account is play soul arcade games now you guys are probably all like a party we already know you have to play games to get gems like come on i came to this video to get some expert pro tips that you can't find anywhere else well i'm just gonna include it in this video anyways because this is something that you have to do if you want to really grind and work your way up there in gems so now i'm going to tell you the top three games that will earn you the most gems in the soul arcade just so you don't waste your time playing games like hedgehog trying to get a million gems starting it off with jama derby you can earn up to a hundred gems in just one round playing this game and one round goes goes by pretty fast. I'm pretty sure it's less than a minute for every single round you play. And then the second best game that you can play in the Slur Arcade is Best Dressed, which will earn you a whopping 200 gems per round. And finally, I'm sure you guys all know the absolute money maker of Animal Jam. Yes, that's right. Of course, I'm talking about Falling Phantoms, which can earn you up to 385 gems in just one round playing it. And get this, what's even better is that one round is only one minute. So if you take this math and you just ace 10 rounds of Falling Phantoms in 10 minutes, that will get you three 3,850 gems. So playing the right Animal Jam minigames is definitely a huge part of getting really rich on Animal Jam. And then for thing number two, it is actually something that so many people overlook and don't even take the few seconds out of their day to do this. And that is entering free Animal Jam promo codes. And some of these codes can get you up to even a thousand gems whenever you enter them. So obviously this is a huge help because they're legit just free gems. And Animal Jam updates their codes a lot. Like they expire a lot of them and they add new ones. So if any of you out there want to see an updated code video, in the future just let me know in the comment section down below because i would be glad to tell you all them and then the next thing is something that i probably would not recommend but it's like if you're really desperate for gems then you can do this and that is the diamond exchange in the diamond shop now the best deal you can get is 15,000 gems for 10 diamonds so if you ever were going to do this and you just have a ton of diamonds to spare just buy a lot of these 15,000 gems with all the diamonds that you have and you could get like a hundred thousand gems so easily and now let's move on to the part of the video where i tell you guys some methods of getting gems fast that not every Every single other person that made a video like this would tell you about. So one really good step of getting a ton of gems like really quickly is just going into Jama Township and putting a Dem beta that you don't really care about that much on your trade list. Or it could be like a wristband that you don't really care that much about. Then just dance in Jama Township and say 20 Rare to Mondays for the item on my trade list. And if someone that has a lot of gems doesn't really need their Rare to Mondays, they're probably going to trade you them. And if you do this enough with a bunch of Dem betas that you don't care about or rares that you don't care about, you can get a ton of gems just by recycling the Rare to Mondays that you get. Also on the topic of Rarity on Monday, sometimes Animal Jam releases a Rarity on Monday that they completely mess up on, and they make it so that you can buy the Rarity on Monday for like 400 gems, but then you can recycle it for a thousand gems. And if that ever happens again, like it did over the summer, then that is your ticket to becoming an Animal Jam millionaire instantly. Just look at this video clip from Wisteria Moon's video where she takes a Rarity on Monday that Animal Jam messed up on and makes so many gems because of it. You know what? Let's recycle all these and see how many gems we get. 10,000, 11,000, 12,000, 13, 14, 15, 16. 17, 18, 33, 34, 35, 48, 49, 50. Wow! 50,000 gems. Would you look at that? Then something that a lot of people have actually forgotten about over the years is the app called AJ Jump. And the cool thing about the AJ Jump app is that it can actually earn you gems on the go. That's right. It's an app that you can download on your iPhone or Android device. And it's just like sky high. So while you're jumping, you get gems and everything like that. And you can transfer the gems that you get on AJ Jump to your Animal Jam account. So let's say you have a long bus ride in the morning and you want something to do. Just go download the AJ Jump app, which costs a dollar, I think, unless they made it free. And play AJ Jump on your bus rides like every day and you can rack up a ton of gems on that and then finally the last method of getting gems which i'll tell you which isn't like a complete waste of time is to recycle anything that you do not need so honestly i do not need a ton of the animals that i've made so hold on just give me a second and i'm gonna recycle a few of them so i legit just recycled a full two pages of my pets that i really never turned into or used and it got me a quick 4,000 gems just like that and you can do the same 
thing to your clothing inventory, your den inventory, your music inventory even, and just whenever you really don't need something, then just go ahead and recycle it for whatever gems it's worth. And yeah guys, those are all of the tips to get gems quick that I've used over my Animal Jam career to become the millionaire that I am today, and I hope that you guys can use some of them after watching this video too, and work your way up there in gems so that you'll never have to worry about like getting any more ever again. So yeah, for today's comment of the day, I want you guys to put how many gems you have in the comment section down below, along with a tip that you have that I may have forgot to put in this video. And with that being said, thank you all so much for watching, and don't forget to leave a swag like, a swag comment, and a swag scribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. A pario. Oh, <laughs>